Hello everyone. Welcome back to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So today I'm going to show you this. So we have implemented this uh, horse riding system and placing our foot on the stirrups and the last time using two bone Nike as you can see here and again I have another problem so if I get down from this character this happens see my character's animation blueprint should be changed when I get down or dismount from the horse so I'll quickly show you how to fix that problem so this is my CH human character and here I implemented this change animation blueprint event and from my horse class yeah when I mount the horse I have called that in here when I mount the horse I changed the characters animation blueprint to BPA horse rider so now when I dismount that means it uh, happens here I should change my animation blueprint so here I don't have to do this stop any montage again because I'm not using that approach anymore yeah here I have to change animation blueprint in here let's do it here and as the input I should give BPA human compile and let's check right now it is working fine and let's get down yeah wait a minute now I have this problem that happens because why it happens because the uh, in my animation blueprint I think I am not getting the these updates let me show you yeah so here this human here I calculate the speeds right here and they are not taking place yeah they are not taking place as my BP character well, let's check this one and this one right we have two active instances of this CH player objects and why is that BPA human we have two active instances of BPA human animation blueprint so I think this is because I have yeah I already had a animation instance with this with this BPA human class by the time I embark, I dism I mount on the horse, but there, using this method, I changed that animation blueprint, and when I dismount, I again create a new animation blueprint. So that should be what's happening. Let's confirm, check and confirm it again. I'll play it first here and yeah 
now if I check here I have only one BPA human animation instances animation blueprint instances and it is updating this speed side and speed forward and everything that's because it has this valid BP character preference now let's mount here okay and let's check what happens here right now this part is not taking place because uh, this BPA human character uh, animation blueprint is no longer in use so that's why this update animation part is not taking place okay so let's see what happens when I dismount right still still this is not active because I am not using this anymore and here I have a new BPA human character animation blueprint instance this is the one that would be created when I call this function here right so if I change it to back to this now you see this update animation is happening but my BP character variable is null or none so that's why these movements are not taking place right so how can we fix it all right so let's fix the first problem that after dismounting character not working animation character doesn't play in work animations so here that's because this pp character variable is invalid so i am setting this variable right here with the event blueprint begin play and so instead of using this begin play what if i use this one event blueprint initialize animation let's try using that one right and yeah that is working so yeah the reason was that this begin play is working only once when I start playing the game I think and this one is called again even after I change the anime instance class and create a new one okay so that problem is fixed and yeah that problem is fixed like this it is working without any issue and but still we have this problem that the other instance of the animation blueprint is not destroyed so actually I'm not sure what to do about this even though my system is uh, working correctly without any issue I think this can cause some performance problems I am not 100% sure this thing should be automatically handled in, in the game but this can be a problem but for now I'm gonna forget about that and continue with my series and meantime if I find a solution for that I will gladly share with you guys and all right so that's all I want to do for today and as always this episode is sponsored by these awesome people 
and if you also like to support my work you can go to this my patreon page code like me and there you can join my patreon club depending on the tier you join you will have different privileges as i have explained in this section and all right so see you in the next episode goodbye